In today's English lesson, I will teach you the difference between the words wonder and wander. Let's get started. Don't miss a lesson. Click the red subscribe button, then click the bell. Hello, Real Fluency friends. I'm Trisha, and I'm here to teach you real English used in real life so that you can reach real fluency now. And in today's lesson, I will teach you the difference between the words wonder and wander. Wonder as a noun means something or someone that is very amazing or a feeling that comes from seeing something that is amazing. A couple sample sentences are, they were filled with wonder as they saw the rocket blast off into space. The Great Pyramid of Giza is one of the seven wonders of the world. As a verb, wonder means to be interested or curious about something, or it's sometimes used to ask a question. He used to wonder why we haven't made contact with aliens yet. I wonder what he is doing right now. She was wondering if he would give her a personal tour of one of his businesses. I wonder if you could give me directions to the factory? There was also a TV show a long time ago called The Wonder Years. And I don't know if, if you can watch it on YouTube, but you could do a search to see if you can find it. It was a cute show. And there's also a bread called Wonder Bread that we used to eat all the time in my family when I was a kid. And you'll see a picture of a package of it on, in the thumbnail image for this video. Some related words are wonderful, as in, it's wonderful that everyone is here and having a great time. Wander, as a verb, means to go to different places with no plans or purpose. A wanderer is a person who wanders. Some sample sentences are, don't wander off, you might get lost. And he was wandering around by himself when the police found him. Carl Sagan once said, exploration is in our nature. We began as wanderers and we are wanderers still. It's now time for the shark quiz. The answers will be at the bottom of this, the, the description, but try not to cheat. Try to answer them first before you look at the answers. For the quiz, fill in the blanks with either wonder, wander, wondering, or wandering. Number one, she was filled with blank when she saw the solar eclipse. Number two, if you don't pay attention, he will blank away from everyone. Number three, I blank if he would go out with me. Number four, he was blank if it was possible for me to move closer to where he lives. Number five, they were blank around for a long time and no one knew where they were. Now, if you're wondering how to get more English help from me, then practice your English in the comments. And that's all for today's lesson. But don't wander off. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel over here. And down here, you can sign up to get emails and other English help from me. And down here, you can watch another English lesson from me. Goodbye. And remember, with hope, anything is possible.